Hello everyone, my name is NerdBuilder and I'd like to welcome you in to the third episode of our Mind Colony series. I'm very excited for uh, to be back with another episode here and today we're going to be doing um, some more building here. Today we're actually going to put a tavern in. Um, the tavern is a good, it's actually recommended in the uh, Mind Colony's wiki, but it's also a good a good. Um, third like another i guess a second build technically because this was technically our first build there but also it comes at a convenient time if you have the seasons pack installed because as you can see it is quite colorful out here and i think winter is just upon us so in the last couple live streams we've been doing some maintenance stuff around here and i was gathering some supplies and you could see that the crops are also going to be a lot different over there as the sun um, begins to set but you know kind of getting a gauge um, and you know a place for our uh, colonists to sleep I think is going to be pretty huge at this point and yeah so I think that's what we're going to end up doing today so we've also been working on getting a lot more animals as you can kind of see there are a ton of cows over there and we have you know I kind of evened up the crops here and so far we've been doing uh, pretty well so I've been trying to keep tabs on this this area might actually have to be cleared out soon and so can this one i guess um we want it we want to you know maybe stock up on grain before the winter will hit but so what we're going to do now is we're going to head over and we're going to have to sleep in the interim before we do this but what i'm going to do is i am going to uh make the appropriate um uh, block you know to start a tavern so as was with the builder um you could see that there are specific blocks to use so something that you're going to need is a barrel and you're going to need some oak planks so we're going to go around here and we're going to fill up the edges of our crafting table here and we're going to take our barrel and put it into here and put our builder's tool on top and you can see we're going to get this little block the tavern block and we're also going to get the new recipes that come along with that there and as the sun sets so i guess we'll get ready to sleep but yeah so we're gonna we're gonna place this down probably i guess over here maybe a little bit more in the middle i want to leave some room here and hopefully not have everything on top of each other but what we'll do is we'll sleep and then we'll get that down in just a second here It'll be nice because we'll have our, our colonists will have a nice place to sleep. And I think they've been getting kind of antsy. They've also been demanding jobs now as well. And unfortunately, we only have we have an unemployment rate of 75%. So <laughs> that's something we're going to have to address, I guess. And this should hopefully be the first part of that. So I think right about maybe here. So let's try this. Let's use our build tool here. And let's see so we'll go to the tavern here and i think we've been doing we've been doing a how does the oak one look because again we do have some stone kind of and ignore that the stone one looks pretty nice i think how do you actually how do you actually get into this place was it on the other side i just missed the door maybe very possible I don't think it made a door. Oh, it's supposed to be over here. Oh, that went right past. <laughs> Oops. Well, let's take a look at... Um, interesting. I think we might actually go with the stone one. I'm thinking the medieval oak looks kind of nice, but I think the stone one looks better there so what we're gonna do is let's make sure that we're above ground this time and i think we're actually a little bit above ground there i think yeah this should be right at um right on the ground so let's just do some positioning here again push esc to back out to kind of observe and i think we're gonna push this back a little bit too I do want to leave some room in between here. Although the tavern, you cannot upgrade at all. Some of these other buildings you're going to be able to upgrade. I'm thinking this might be a good spot because I want to leave some room in between. I do want to put down a road and everything in between. So, 
and that so let's go ahead and I think we should be good but I think it is on the ground level I believe there so all right let's go ahead and lock that in there and <laughs> immaculate timing it starts to rain all right so let's see what we're going to need here um all right so we are going to need beds a laying barrel okay so these are all the things that we're going to need on here in order for him to um be able to construct this so i'm gonna have some gathering i'm gonna have to gather some material i can see there's a lot of cobblestone luck we've been building that up and i'm gonna have to make a few different types of barrels but i think for the most part even the black carpet i think this isn't too difficult so what i think that we're going to do is i am going to um i'm going to back out right now and on the other end of this small little break i'm going to come back with all of this material and we are going to get our builder uh starting so we will be right back all right and we're back finally gathered all of the materials and put them over in this chest i actually jumped the gun uh just a bit here and you could see maddox is um has already started doing some of the digging on the property here and it took a lot to get all of the materials that were needed here so you could see um i, I had a bunch in inventory already we've we've had cobblestone from clearing out the um the hill in the back back there um but you know it, it took some specialty stuff which is why i highly recommend you know the jei mod pack here because you could see i was actually looking up for a standing barrel um which we needed a few of there but again and this is why i you know i can't stress enough about um prep and doing things in advance because you know right now we're kind of you know i, I don't know what's going to end up happening with winter but you could see we are clearly into fall and i'm hoping they get the tavern built before um, the weather starts to change because again, I don't know what effect that's going to have on the uh, colonist if anything on there I have noticed noticed some more um, ice kind of forming on the water. So um, Yeah, so Maddox has gotten started. You can see he's been digging out already I think I'm gonna have to probably supply him with some more um, With a couple more oak shovels and whatnot, but what we're gonna do is um, you know I'm gonna let him build all of this out you could see here, I, I think I have everything in the event that I don't, I will run and gather it. It took a little bit of time <laughs> there, but um, yeah, so I'm going to let Maddox kind of, you know, do his thing here and, oh, okay, just wanted to make sure that there was not a giant hole under there. And um, yeah, so I'm going to give Maddox the materials to get started. And once we, um, once he gets it built, we'll come back and um, we will talk about it a little bit more and show the finished design so stay tuned and we'll be right back after this all right so i just wanted to cut back in because maddox had finished um digging here and then he ran back into the hut and he was gone for a couple minutes um you know i'm not sure what he was doing you know i went and looked and he was just kind of chilling in there um and it looks like he actually saved some materials that i had gathered previously for that build i think that he must have kept and put them in there um, but you could see he's got a few other demands for things now. Um, the interesting thing is, again, like it, it, some of these things do not match up with like the items that it, it discusses that it like needs, which I've noticed is interesting because when we kind of look at the build menu, it tends to provide a lot more, and that could be over the the life of the building, perhaps instead of just. And I think he's mad because he's out now but let's get him some more stuff so you know I, i'm still trying to figure that out a little bit and if you know you know please feel free to drop a comment in the chat you know i'm almost wondering if you know because there's a lot of materials that it's requesting you know in excess of what he actually needs so i'm just wondering if that's the materials he's going to need like further down the road and that even though I, i'm pretty sure you can't upgrade um you can't upgrade the tavern. So what I'm also going to do is I'm just going to clear some more space. I was grabbing some of the dirt from him since we're going to need it for terraforming. And when I didn't grab it from him before, um, he just kind of threw it away. <laughs> so he went back in there. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring him a bunch of stuff. I know right now specifically he's asking for cobblestone. And I think he was asking for stairs too. Maybe. So let me... Do we have all the cobblestone? So let me see what else I should have, I should have took another look, but, um, yeah, very interesting that there's a little bit of a disconnect there. So, but let's take a look and see what he wants here. I'm just going to try to keep a better note of it. 
to okay so he does want one because i know originally um it had asked for well maybe for more standing rails actually no some of this stuff okay so 62 cobblestone stairs 61 cobblestone slabs all right so i'm gonna give him for right now and it actually looks like he took one of the beds himself all right so i'm gonna dump this in here and we're gonna dump that in there i think that should get him maybe somewhat started for now i'm gonna grab a bunch of the other materials um i just don't want him i think he'll put them back in his work chest and not just throw them away so maybe i'll just give it to him and that because i know i had called for four beds um in there so i'm gonna give him all these materials because if anything he can just hold on to them um i don't think he needed that many stairs I know he needed some glass panes and he needed some slabs. All right, so he's back out here doing some building. All right, he's already got a couple doors it looks like, but we'll we'll throw some more stuff in here. All right, he's excited. He's running. All right, and I'm pretty sure we asked for the slabs. And let's see what else. Glass panes, I think I forgot to grab those. So let me just grab those really quick there. So, so ju just something to keep in mind, but it's, um, oh, here they are. This this um shader pack makes glass panes look very uh weird. Oh, Maddox, chill, bro. All right. So we'll toss these in there. And all right, well, it appears he has everything he needs for the time being. Um, so some of the stuff he didn't actually, um, end up needing like all these stairs so we'll keep these for future builds and the black carpet and the four beds i guess for some reason so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to put these back in here I, I was pretty sure that he needed them at least that's what it said he's saying no now again it could have just been part of a different design he is very excited for this and um yeah <laughs> there so, so just something to keep in mind so you know if it's something you're confused on like what they're looking for you know feel free to drop back into the video and you know pause in that certain area that way um you know you can kind of see the materials and whatnot and hopefully he's going to be oh there he goes i was going to say hopefully he's going to be okay um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep letting them build and then we'll come back on the other side. I just wanted to drop in just because like I, I've noticed that with the builder's hut, I thought I had gathered some of the wrong materials, but I'm starting to think that for some reason there's a disconnect between one menu and the other. So we'll drop back in and I'll update to see if he asked for some of the other stuff that we had prepared and that, and then, um, we'll check out the final build. So we'll be back right in a few minutes. All right. So I just wanted to cut back in. Um, again, I know I've cut in and out a few times here. Um, winter has arrived and it arrived just a few days ago, uh, maybe two days ago. Uh, Maddox has been working very hard on the house and it appears that progress has temporarily stopped because of the winter storm. Um, but we could see here that the inside is coming along really nice and he's been working hard. And as an update, he did use the rest of the, um, materials or he did request them. So he has been busy. And it looks like he has been making bedrooms and that snow is kind of piling up in here, um, which is cool. Interesting. Okay. Um, so it looks like he's almost done. Um, so far, there, ha there haven't been any negative effects yet for them being in winter other than like right now, you know, with the snowstorm, he, you know, they're all kind of huddled up here. Um, they've been getting a little bit more, I think, disgruntled just in general there but you could see because again like you know as i've mentioned before we do have you know the seasons mod pack also installed so not it would normally not snow in this area but it has you know started so while he's been while maddox has been building you know i've been kind of i went and picked up a bunch more of the grain crops uh wheat crops grain crops here and replanted you could see that all interesting enough all of the water has also frozen um, through here is more of a gradual onset and even our infinite water source here has frozen and you can see along the coast here um, that there is some freezing going on in the water water around the coast which is pretty cool um, doesn't look like any snow went on the ship though but yeah so 
you know, this is part of this. And I think like, you know, right now we're just going to have to wait out the storm. I, I was worried that there might be some kind of effect, but they seem to be okay. They're not disgruntled. You know, I haven't been getting any kind of, you know, any kind of effect from being out in the snow right now. They're, I think they're general, you know, um, they're upset. They're just upset about, yeah, that, yeah. Okay, but the goal with this is that they're hopefully going to have a place to stay here upon the completion of the tavern. So I think we're so close. I mean, if we would have just had one more day, I think he would have finished here. But what we're going to do is I'm going to zoom back out again. I just wanted the cutting because you could see now that snow is kind of going to dominate the entire landscape here. Um, it's really filling up there. And there was, some, there was a little bit of snow from a very brief snowstorm that had started there and you can see actually oh, well all of that yeah here you know you can see the grass patches quickly disappearing there um i'm almost wondering if i should just move the campfire in the middle here and that i don't know if it would matter i don't know if it matters or not but oh did i just destroy it i think i just destroyed it oops there Anyways, yeah, so I, I think they're okay. I'll continue to monitor it. But what we're going to do is I'll, I'll cut back out again, and then I, th I think after the next time um, we should be ready to show off the tavern. So stay tuned, and we'll be right back. All right, and we're back, and it looks like we have, it looks like Maddox has come through, and we have finally finished the tavern. And it looks like someone has actually stopped by. Um, Lillian is someone that we could recruit um to our um civilization it looks like she's trying to get out of here anyways but for right now i'm not going to recruit anyone and the reason being is because again if you get over seven and you can see everyone else is coming down um right now everyone um okay let me out of here um everyone came in here and at night because again like maddox had finished just just a little bit before the uh start the the um night time and it looks like now that we are all complete and that we do have four beds, so they do have a place to sleep. I saw on the bottom, you know, um, when I went to bed that it recommended maybe building a forest or a miner next. So it's definitely something I'm going to look into because I think we're going to try to move a little bit quicker because really, you know, winter, the snow has stopped, but winter is in full bloom here. So, you know, I... um. You know, I, I definitely want to, um, you know, continue to grow here. But just to take a look around on the inside, and Maddox did end up using all of the resources requested. He did just request them little by little here. So you can see the downstairs here very much looks like a tavern. Here you can see that there's a nice little storage area there. And then upstairs here you can see that there are some uh, beds, and actually it looks like No has been hanging out up here as well. But that they did install some uh, beds in here and in here as well so very cool stuff with a barrel to put stuff in here but um yeah this is the tavern so i was very excited to see this get finally built i know this is one for a while that i've been wanting to well build that we've been working towards it to give people a place to sleep and we're finally here and you can see here um you know we're, we're going to be able to um that there are four citizens um assigned here so very good stuff. You know, I'm going to look to, you know, I, I think we should be able to assign a job here as well. Let me just take a quick look here because I'm pretty sure I would do it on the on the interface in there. Um, hire mercenaries. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, worker hiring mode, automatic, automatic. Okay. So one of them should have been, I don't know if, if no was hired you know, for it. Let me just see, because I know with the builder interface that it, um, oh, well, not the, they're interesting. Okay. Okay, but they're all assigned here anyway, so good stuff. Um, I'll play around with it a little bit more, but yeah, I, I think we're going to, I think we're going to call it a, um, a episode here guys i know that this one went on a little bit long but just so much stuff happening here 
So I think we'll be back the next time. Um, we're going to build probably another building or two in the next episode. You know, I'll keep you guys posted here. And of course, you know, we will be doing some more live streams um, to gather some more materials because this tavern really took a lot <laughs> of material. So I have a feeling we're going to have to gather a bunch more before we uh, start our next build. But my name has been Nerd Builder. Thank you so much for stopping in. If you did enjoy this video, please consider uh, dropping a like below. And if you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. You know, I try to upload fairly frequently um, new episodes here. So if you do have an interest in the series, uh, you know, please consider, uh, you know, dropping a subscribe in down below. Until next time, my name is Nerd Builder. Take care and we'll see you soon.